Jr. with Amplified Minds again. I just wanted to quickly run through a follow-up to the last video I sent um, to you about uh, reaching out over LinkedIn. So if you remember, I reached out to a guy and this is really cool because this is kind of like a, a live action case study. Um, that message that I sent in the last video I recorded was a real message sent to a real person and I was using my um, communication strategies to you know get in ear with this person. So this is pretty cool. But if you remember that person's name was Coach David Lubin, right? And Coach David Lubin, we were we thought we'd write this message. We said, hi, Coach David. I love your mission and your profile. Wealth and abundance is something we should all promote. So that was my tie-in and a connection to him. Following that, in the second paragraph, I said, I'd love to connect and learn more about what you do as a life coach. I help coaches scale their business, and this is our tagline, and programs by providing accountability partners to their clients. Would you have 15 minutes to jump on a call to see if I can add value to your business? Also, to see how we can help each other. Thanks for your time, and I signed my name with my information down below. Now, um, something that Matt and I have recently discussed over here at Amplified Minds is that um, any first email you send should be no more than five lines. Never, because no one's going to read it. LinkedIn's a little bit different because it's a it's a social platform, but um, even then, I would highly recommend keeping it to a very short, you know, five lines maximum. If you're trying to get a hold of somebody's attention, right? Uh, and this one was really interesting, a little, a little lucky because we, we did more than five lines, but there you go. Well, to continue off our, our previous video discussion, uh, as I scroll down below, you'll notice that coach David Lubin responded. And I think this is a cool case study for all of you to see because just watch what he's done here. Hey, John Kovacs Jr., um, which is really interesting because not many people will respond with your full name. Usually they'll respond with just your first name or, hey, thanks. And uh, um, this kind of indicates to me that he has an automated system that's working on his end with his LinkedIn to respond to people who message him. But Nonetheless, he's given me some information to connect with him, which is bar none the best option for us at this point, including his email, if you see that down below. So let's connect and miracles happen in people's lives, if you see that. So, hey, John, let's connect and miracle ha miracles happen in people's lives. I love it because he's literally responding to the thing that we said above, which is, I love your mission and your profile. Everyone should promote a wealth and abundance. So he's given me an email. He's given me a Facebook page, which I've already gone to, and I've liked his Facebook page. I've tried to connect with him there. And uh, he has an Instagram, so I've been following him on Instagram as well. And this is just so that I can get some more information about him. But I'm already invested in this guy, okay? He's already a contact of mine. Um, he's someone that I'm interested in learning more. <laughs> Jeez, you, <laughs> you just see, this is why this is such a funny feature. Um, anyways, as you see, uh, I've been able to reach out to him uh, via LinkedIn and he asked for um, you know a response, but he's looking for me to connect elsewhere. So this is kind of an, an idea to me that he wants me to email him and connect with me elsewhere because he doesn't have enough time to check his LinkedIn. So that's, that's a really cool indicator that I have found by just this short message. So what I'm going to end up doing is, and I think this is a really cool case study, is I'm actually going to write him an email and to follow up. And for those of you who are, um, you know, just interested in what that email might look like, and so I don't pull open my email and you have access to that, let me just write a, a sample email here. So I'm going to say, this is to Mr. Coach Lubin. Oh, yeah. Okay. Hi, Coach. David. Thank you for your response. On LinkedIn. I really want to connect with you to learn more about your coaching program. <clears throat> and then if you remember in his in his email or in his response to me, he said, let's connect and miracles happen in people's lives. I actually don't know what the heck that means. It sounds like a broken sentence, but I'm going to take it verbatim and I'm going to respond to him and I'm going to say, I want to, and I'm just going to copy and paste this and edit it a little bit, right? So I want to connect 
so that we can make miracles happen in people's. And <laughs> I am a communications major, therefore I I, I know uh, punctuation. Um, there, so there you go. You got a little punctuation thing there. And then, yeah, I want to make people live. Um, do you um, – Let's do this. Can we connect? And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to put in my signature friend and fan. And I'm going to do just like I did in LinkedIn. Now, this is the hope that this guy will respond. That this guy will see my creativeness and that my desire to connect with him because I believe that there's something that we both have that can change the world. Accountability will bless the people that he has in her his programs or whatever he thinks accountability will work for him. And uh, I believe that what he's doing is incredible. Okay, Wealth and abundance is something that everyone should pursue, should promote, should talk about because it's an incredible thing. So with that said, I just wanted to show you this really cool. I'm going to send that email to Coach Lubin today and I want you to see how this plays out. But I just wanted to, you know, so that wasn't just like a bunch of broken training videos. I wanted you to see what it would be like to have, uh, a, you know, this 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 option of. And I didn't realize I covered up my face. There we go. There's my face. I wanted you to be able to see the play out of what these conversations are like. So as you continue to reach out to people, always follow up, always be willing to take a quick action and respond to whether it's go to their Facebook page and like it or their Instagram or, you know, send them an email, whatever it is, do it because that's going to allow you to increase your network. So this is just a few minutes with John. Uh, I hope this was helpful for your sales training. And uh, if you have any questions, just let us know. Thanks.